What rhymes with fork humor? Dark humor? Ha ha ha! That's what we're gonna be doing today, ladies and gentlemen. Obviously. Fuck me. If you are new to the channel, just let me- Hold on, hold on. Wait, before we get into this, make, let me take a quick puff. If you are new to the channel and you want to stick around for a while, there's a button down below that says subscribe. It's actually a red button. If you click it one time, you get eight ninety nine dollars transferred into your bank account. I said last video it was $10, but it came down because of the economic crisis. You know, everything going on. It's prices have to get put up and down. I don't know why the prices would go down due to an economic crisis. That doesn't make sense. But anyway, if you want to subscribe, there's a button down below. This is Family Guy. Incredibly dark humor compilation. Don't get offended. If you get offended, and you're offended. All right. Peter, I'm gonna have to call the police on this. What? Why? It's to get our wives back to get it. Peter, these are hundreds of naked babies in suggestive situations. And their timestamp is oh God. far back as 1998, which is way before we had this idea. I need help. It'll flatten any Jew. Simply climb behind the wheel, drive it towards a Jew, and flatten him. Did he also use it just to drive from place to place and stuff? It, it's a Jew flattening machine. It, it's not what it's designed for. But you could use it that way. Yeah, yeah, you could. Yeah, yeah, you could, you could also use the Mona Lisa as a placemat. Always fight for what you believe in, like Patrick Henry. Give me liberty or give me death. Oh. Jesus Christ! I know, right? Ryan wanted to give him liberty. You do the paperwork, Ryan. Where do you think you are? This isn't a doctor's office. This is the pound. You're being euthanized. What? Jess is having me put down? Oh my god, this can't be happening. Did you also eat a kid? The fuck? These camps don't sound fun at all. Well, Chris, camp is only as fun as you make it. That's how it was in World War II. Don't suppose it would help to say I have a note from my doctor. <laughs> Get in there, you. <laughs> What the hell? Oh, for God's sakes, where's that white noise machine? Help! Help! Oh, my God! Help! Somebody help me! <sighs> Let me get this straight. None of you guys has ever heard of Bono. He says he knows you. Daddy, what the hell are you doing? You throw Peter in jail? Hey, pumpkin, welcome! Whatever you do, don't tell them you have a clitoris. Yeah, they told me that at the embassy. Oh, see? Laughter is the best medicine. Please, sir, I'm in so much pain. Shut up and listen to my material. Huh, what's this? Bedpan, Peter Pan. Oh, next stop is Neverland. Come, Wendy, fly with me. Ho uh ho. -huh. Is that supposed to be Robin Williams? What are you doing here? I thought you were having Thanksgiving with your parents. Oh, uh... Chris got caught watching Cousin Katie pee, so that kind of ended things. No, I wanted to get caught. That's, that's part of it. Nice spot, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's great. Especially because of that thing over there. You know what's in there? Corn. Really? Wow. Don't I touch it, please. Corn. Nah, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> You're dark, Raj. I don't care. Yeah. Brown family. Oh, oh, my goodness. I'm, I'm so sorry. Sometimes I write descriptions of my patients to help me remember them. No, it's okay. Our last name is Brown. Oh, okay. Phew. Ah, then this must be Chubster Dum Dum. <laughs> oh my god, I almost didn't do it. I almost didn't do it. I thought, is this in bad taste? But you know what? I went for it. I went for it, and I am so glad I did. Oh, worth it. Totally worth it. I assume you heard of the alphabet. You want to explain to me how Sammy Popsicle comes before napping various? Jeez, I'm sorry. Well, can we watch Lost Boys? I've heard of that one. Those? Those are different Lost Boys. Blind Justice. He lost his sight, but not his vision. Not his vision. I need you to go down to 54th and Main. Talk to the suspect's wife. While you're there, see if you can get a sample of his hair to match his DNA. All right, I'm on it. In local news, there was a hit and run by a drunk driver today at Quahog Park. Two children are missing. <gasps> I was just there. <laughs> hmm. I'm starting to think that guy wasn't a real modeling agent. And I'm starting to think that other guy wasn't a real penis butt inspector. What the hell happened to all the smart genes in this family? I mean, I invent the razor blade comb, and my kids are doing nothing. I mean, when Chris grows up, will he even be able to get a job or take care of himself? And oh, what's God, do I don't like to get it off. Well, there's a new procedure that, if administered immediately, should restore his ability to walk. $200,000. We also have a wheelchair. $60. Okay. They're going with B. 
Hey, Meg, I stood outside Planned Parenthood for 36 hours, and here are the pictures of every girl in your class who went in. All right, good. Now I want you to call them as if you're their dead baby. Really? Yeah, that'd, that'd be great. Oh, I could use the money, and I'm getting kind of tired of my old job. Only a half a point divides our top two competitors as we enter the last event, the Meg Roll. I'm Why sorry, would she agree Chris, to do Jerome that? Jerome just doesn't think his daughter should date a white guy. Black racism is the biggest problem facing this country today. I, I can't, I can't believe. I don't know. <laughs> Looking back, I think it may have been real butter. Your husband murdered three children. Oh my God! This is so much faster than fire. <laughs> Why, I'm out of all of Facebook. jokes we have just listened to, I have laughed at a butter joke. It's auto-filling, fat butt butter. rodeo. Peter! You were supposed to stay on Firefox. <laughs> I'm not going to listen to that bozo. Of course I'm still wearing it. Watch me jump this line. Excuse me, I have scoliosis. Excuse me, scoliosis coming through. Hey, pal. Polio. A thousand apologies. I'm really, really sorry about your big noses. I'm really sorry about how greedy you are. But most of all, I'm really sorry about your dirty, underhanded, backstabbing ways. Your number one dirty Jew fan, Mel Gibson. Goodbye, friends. Goodbye, free time. <laughs> Farewell, sex. So long, Gulf on TV. I'll miss you, Brian. I don't think he's Goodbye, sorry at all, to be honest. How many beers I've had. Nice knowing you, my own choices. See you later, money. We now return to the NBA on TNT. Don't think Mel Gibson is LSD. sorry for anything. Oh, f*** me. Man, I'm out my mind. We now return to Meredith Baxter in Raped by a Clown. It was awful. He made me do things. Awful things. What kinds of things? I don't even want to talk about it. Here's my post office key. I need you to go downtown and get the stuff from my P.O. box. You... you don't get your mail here? No. I get a lot of private correspondence from the Netherlands. Like what? Like, I'm part of a group that kind of trashes Anne Frank's house every year. To go to the library to wipe boogers in fancy books. What? I like to wipe mine in Bronte novels. It's like a time bomb to gross out lonely chicks. Oh, Heathcliff. Oh, come on! I want so little! Well, ladies and gentlemen, we've got to end another video. Just before we end this, I know some of these jokes that we've probably seen them before. It's because they're, like, they're the same type of video, but uploaded by different people. So they're titled the same, so they might have some of the same clips in them. I still find them bloody funny. I still find them hard not to laugh at. So I do hope you enjoy them. If you admit to react to anything, Put it down below. I asked you guys in the community section for, you know, some suggestions to react to some shit. And you put loads in, so I've got loads. I actually wrote down in my uh, my book over here, if you take if you want to take a look. Videos. Ideas. So if you want to continue to do that, go and comment on the community section. I'll write it down. Thank you for being you. Thank you for being a sub. I appreciate you more than you'll ever know. Goodbye.